Los Angeles, me and my best friend Amy Dubo, who is literally right here behind the camera, and we are being digital nomads for the week in LA. We're staying at a landing property right now, which is amazing. If you're a digital nomad, you need to get on landing because you can basically get a short-term or long-term apartment rental for a good price anywhere in the US. So that's what we're doing while we're here. Also have a code in the description if you want to check it out or on the screen. But right now we are about to go to Air One, Santa Monica, Venice, do some work at a cafe and just enjoy the California sunshine. We arrived yesterday and we did proper Elefante for a drink and then ended up in West Hollywood. Interesting vibes over there, but we're gonna have a very wholesome work productive trip and I wanted to bring you guys along with me. So excited to be here, so excited to be working with Amy. We actually work together quite a bit and we're doing a lot of content and gonna do some exciting and fun things. Let's begin the trip, but before we do that, give this video a thumbs up, hit subscribe if you haven't already, connect with me on Instagram and TikTok, I'm so active there. And sign up for my course waitlist because I'm teaching you how to become digital nomad now so you can Join me on this little journey of mine. But yeah, let's go to Air One. Okay, we're ready to go. The lighting in this apartment is not the best, especially this overhead lighting, but I wanted to show you my outfit. I'm wearing this super cute top from Set Active, then this sweater from Potflex, aloe leggings. I was skeptical about aloe leggings. I was like, Honestly, it isn't worth the money, but the fit is unbeatable. Like I'm obsessed with them. And this necklace is from Madrid. This one is from Georgiana. My mom just got it for my birthday. And this is from Maggie Villa Maria. I absolutely love this little chain. New Balance sneakers, 530s. All of these things are linked on my like to know it. Follow me on like to know it if you haven't already. But yeah, let's go to Air One because I'm freaking hungry. We have arrived at Air One. I drove in LA and didn't crash the car, so give me a little applause. I'm so excited. We're actually really hungry because it's almost 1 p.m. and we haven't really eaten anything yet, but we're gonna get smoothies, food. Let's see what we have. Y'all, the produce section of my literal dream. Look at this. It's a rainbow. It's an actual rainbow. This is non-alcoholic, non-alcoholic spirit. How is it? It's good. It's very fresh. Sushi sandwich. Okay guys, we need to chat because we have a lot of food and we're going to share it with you. We just met the founder of Feed Probiotics. Amy just did a partnership with them and I've been using them for five years. Literally crazy. What? Yeah, it's crazy because I just did like training to be able to be a partner with them and she was in the videos and we were standing right beside her for the first time and we were like, we can't, they can't hear us. Okay, by the way, let's do a little haul. We got two smoothies. Well, it was the Amy smoothie, the Haley Bieber strawberry glaze. This is the cloud smoothie. And then we have, I think my channel is just becoming a mukbang at this point. Mushroom, jerky, habanero. This is our air one haul. Habanero, barbecue flavor, sushi. The infamous sushi sandwich. We have to try it. This looks so good. Tofu sticks. Chicken taquitos because Alex Earl got chicken taquitos. Um, so then we got the chicken taquitos. And these kelp noodles, which look so good. We're gonna try it all, let you know how it goes. I just say driving in LA is humbling and people do whatever they want. So we ended up at a different beach closer to our landing property because we were in Venice and it was so chaotic. The parking situation was not it. So we were like, let's just come here, finish our food, go for a nice walk. The beach looks so beautiful. Can we just take a moment for this? The ocean, the Pacific Ocean, it literally, it makes me feel like home because I grew up in Australia, right on the Pacific Ocean. So, and then in Vancouver. So being by the Pacific in specific is just literally home to me. I'm so excited to go by the water. So let's go over there and I'll continue telling you more. Yesterday, we 
we had a full day of going to Erwan, going for a walk on the beach, lots of fun things. Today we are actually going to be getting to work. It is Monday. We are going to Soho House to work remotely and get a lot of planning and behind the scenes stuff done for my brand, which is Girl Boss Abroad. I'm launching my course very soon. You can sign up for the waitlist down below. In this course, I'm going to teach you how to become a digital nomad, how to grow your wealth, how to build your career as a digital nomad, and how to balance your health and wellness and mindset living this lifestyle because contrary to popular belief, this lifestyle is is not easy and it's not for the week so I want to give you all the tools to make the most out of it but I just went to the gym this morning I feel so much better working out is my non-negotiable when I'm traveling because I know I'm gonna not feel my best if I don't so I did that but yeah I'm gonna finish getting my stuff together and we are going to head out to Soho West Hollywood see you guys there we're going to West Hollywood and I'm driving there's not that much traffic to go because traffic in California scares me. We just left Soho House. We worked there all day and we had a meeting with a couple. So we're working with Lemonade where we post on Lemonade and we kind of had a meeting with people who also connected us to that app. It's a new app. Um, if you haven't heard of it, follow us, Amy DeVoe and Natasha Abraham on Lemonade. But we are going for dinner now. We're in Beverly Hills. We're going to Il Pastillo, which is an Italian restaurant that was recommended to us by so many people. And apparently it is so delicious. And I have not eaten all day except for a coffee and some protein powder because we ate so much yesterday and I wasn't hungry, but now I'm starving. So I'm about to go in on all of this Italian food. I got the Justin Bieber pasta. They named this pasta after Justin Bieber because it's his favorite pasta. I didn't get it because of that. I got it because I really wanted wide rigatoni shaped pasta like this. And I'm going to try it. It's so good. Perfect creaminess, pasta from the tomato, pasta is al dente, so good. And for dessert, tiramisu. It is so incredible. Probably one of the best tiramisu I've ever had. We're back home. I'm so sleepy. We honestly just went to Soho House and worked where I couldn't really film, but I stuck a couple videos. We had a meeting, like I said, before we went to dinner at El Pastillo, which was so good. But after that, honestly, like I got so sleepy and we just came home. Amy's still working, but it's like 9.30. And honestly, I'm about to go to bed because I feel like it's been a long day, even though, well, honestly, it kind of has been. I woke up at around 7, maybe a little bit before, and now it's almost 10, so I think that's a pretty solid day. I'm going to close out this vlog. Tomorrow we're going to go to the Runyon. That's the hike, right? In West Hollywood. And then we're going to go back to Soho House, I think, work, go shopping, because we didn't actually end up going shopping today because we just stayed at Soho House and kept working and then had our meeting. And by the time we finished dinner, I think everything was closed. We just stopped at Sweet Lily Bakery and I got an almond chocolate croissant. If you guys watch my videos, you know I'm obsessed with almond croissants. Mmm, it is so good. Not that warm. And we got coffee. We are almost to Runyon. And now we can resume the vlog. Where did we start? Uh, we started. You're on the Runyon hike right now. And here are some things to note if you're doing this hike. Super windy in certain parts. Gets really chilly. Bring a sweater, but right now it's not that windy. Sun is shining. It is April. Feels good. So if you got cold, bring a light sweater. You know, we'll be good. There's no bathrooms on the trail, so make sure you do that before you come yeah. here. And we were gonna go all the way down and then around. We can go, so you can go up this paved part, I mean, dirt part. Sorry, I'm a little tired now. Now I'm out of breath. And it takes you 
around in a circle, we can. Or you can just go up the paved part. But we'll go up the dirt part just to show you guys what it's like. A little update on the off-roading. We're climbing a mountain right now. So if you're not looking for a crazy hike, definitely stick to the paved walkway. You're gonna be hiking a little mountain. <laughs> some pictures for Girl Boss Abroad because I am launching the Instagram today and actually they turned out super cute. I don't know if you can tell. You guys can't, but I'll show some on the screen right now. And we are at this restaurant in the Grove called Alma, which is Mexican food. We're gonna get some tacos or a salad and then go shopping. We got birria tacos, ensalada and tacos de camarón with shrimp. It looks amazing. I love birria tacos with the consume. Mm. So good. That's my goal to go to Mexico City very soon. That's with birria tacos. Can't wait to go eat all the food. at Belair, which is an agency that I've done work with in the past, and they were so kind to let us come into their showroom and pick out a bunch of goodies. I will do a haul later, but I am literally in heaven right now. There's Aster, Remy Brooke, Blank, all these amazing brands, Havaianas, Urban Decay, so many more, and we're literally able to pick out so many things. Is this real life? <laughs> in Beverly Hills at a restaurant called Great White and it is an Australian brunch restaurant. They are my favorite. I go to Two Hands in Austin all the time. Did my Austin awesome restaurant guide. If you haven't checked it out already, go check it out. The link is down below. But this restaurant looks incredible. It's so aesthetic and beautiful. We got the Great White breakfast plate and the blue spirulina smoothie and I got the Shaken ice latte, which is super good. I forgot to film an outro for my LA vlog, so I'm actually back home in Austin, Texas already, but LA was incredible. I met amazing people. It was so much fun to see my friend Amy and also to work and build those connections and everything. I think it's so important to take trips like that and get out of your comfort zone and into a different environment every now and then because I've kind of been staying put here in Austin and as much as I love it, sometimes you can forget what else is out there and that you can expand and grow so much from these trips. But check out my other videos. I have my Palm Springs vlog up already and I have a lot more videos that I'm posting. I'm posting twice a week, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of them. Watch my shorts, connect with me on Instagram and TikTok and Lemonade. I'm on all those platforms. And my course is coming out soon, so sign up for the waitlist in the description um, if you want to learn how to become a digital nomad and join my female digital nomad community so you can kind of live how I live. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.